We've partnered up with Harmony House this month to spread awareness about domestic abuse. Now today, we're visiting with Diane Holman from Central Tr Trust, and we're talking about something that some people might not ever think about or be aware of, financial abuse. Diane, thank yeah. you for coming. What, what does financial abuse look like? How, how do you know it's happening? Well, there's many different tactics that abusers use. And financial abuse really involves controlling the victim's ability to acquire, use, and maintain their financial resources. Which cripples them further. Well, you know, without finances, you can't pay the rent, you can't pay the utilities, you can't take care of your children. Mm -hmm. So it really cripples that victim into feeling very vulnerable to their abuser. And uh, they, the abuser typically will prevent the uh, individual from using their own finances. Um, many times they will prevent them from working. Um, if they allow them to use their finances, they make them account for every penny that they use. Mm -hmm. This, or, or what you just said there, if they allow them to mm -hmm. use, that is, somehow it seems like there's a legality involved there, but is it sometimes you're boxed in? Uh, uh, yes, sometimes you are boxed in and you feel that you don't have a way out. Uh -huh. uh, and finances, that's how we survive. Mm -hmm you have to have finances mm -hmm. and because that is so important and your abuser is not allowing you to use your finances you can't function without them and that is why many times financial abuse is why most victims uh, will delay in getting help yeah they stay that's right they there's stay really nowhere to go that's I mean right. you, you know you might need money for a ride somewhere and don't even right. know that you mm -hmm. know, you can't so although people don't talk about it a lot this is much more widespread than we oh, realize. Definitely. Well, actually, recent studies have found that 99% of domestic violence starts with financial abuse. And I just think it's important that individuals understand uh, the tactics that victims use or that the abuser yes. uses mm -hmm. uh, to the victim. Uh, you know, sometimes they are, um, they feel that they are entitled to that victim's money or their assets. Uh, and uh, they want them to share their assets and their money, but they will not uh, share their own. In the, this age of digital accounts, they will uh, set up online accounts, and, but will not provide the uh, passwords mm -hmm. for those accounts, so the victim cannot get access to the funds. So you've been with Central Trust for, I think you said, like 11 years. Yes. And I know this eye care initiative with Harmony House is, is a huge deal. We've been talking about it on this show. Mm -hmm. How long have you been involved with Harmony House? Was this a real eye-opener for you when you got involved in this? It, it had to be. It, it is. And, you know, we are a financial company. Yeah. Uh, and we want to share financial advice to individuals. Mm -hmm. And when we're talking about financial abuse, that that is really hits home to us. We don't want anyone to be abused uh, in any way, uh, but financial abuse is just unacceptable. Well, any abuse is unacceptable, oh, sure. but when but. we hear the statistics that domestic abuse uh, starts many times mm -hmm. with financial abuse, we want to get the word out that that is not acceptable. Uh, ladies, men, no one has to has to uh, put up with that yeah and there is a way to get help and that is why I care is so important mm -hmm. and it's important for us central bank and central trust as a financial company to get the word out that there are resources out there that can help individuals get the help that they need. Mm -hmm. And uh, Central Bank and Central Trust, along with other financial companies in town, want to share in eye care and participate in such an important event for the Harmony House. Yeah, so don't feel like you're alone and don't feel like you're so trapped that you can't do anything because frankly, that's what you all do and Harmony That's House correct. is there to help That's people correct. get out of this because yes. you should not have to live like that. And we have a number for We them. do. Yes. Um, mm -hmm. If you think you might be or someone you know might be a victim of financial abuse, here's a number to call 417-864-SAFE, S-A-F-E. Yes. So, you know. Think about it. Do a little soul searching. That's correct. You know, that's what it takes. Right. Harmony House is there to help you. All right. Very good. Diane from Central Trust, thank, thank you, you so much for thank all you Thank you very much. Appreciate You're it welcome. very much. Glad to be here. All right. Up next, what is up at this weekend's box office with Chris the Critic? Stay with us.